Hello, and welcome to another chapter in our series of tutorials that will help you get familiar with using Corel's Photo Album 7. In today's short lesson, I'm going to show you how to integrate PaintShop Pro Photo with your photo editing in Photo Album. PaintShop Pro Photo is a very reasonably priced all-in-one image editing application. It contains simple, easy-to-use tools, as well as more advanced tools for things like masking, color curves, and level support, among many other features. If you have PaintShop Pro Photo, you can launch it from within Photo Album, and it will take any photo you're working on into the application, allow you to edit it with increased precision and advanced features, then automatically bring that newly edited photo back into Photo Album, where it will be updated in any project you're working on. Let me show you how this works. I've opened up a folder of images that need some work here in Photo Album, and I'm also in the Enhance tab, where Photo Album's editing tools are available to me. As you can see, and may remember from another video I did, Photo Album already has some very useful tools to fix photos, but for some images, I just need more. For instance, I'm thinking I should probably apply a quick fix or a photo fix to this faded photo, so let me do that. But as you can see, it could still use some help, so let's undo it, and let's take it over to PaintShop Pro Photo. While I have this photo open, I simply select Advanced Editing with PaintShop Pro Photo, and away I go. Here, I can do more advanced editing. To fix this faded photo, I want to introduce you to the Learning Center. The Learning Center is an excellent method to learn PaintShop Pro Photo, whether you're new to image editing or switching from another application. I simply locate the task I wish to do, and the tool will appear for me. I can also use it to learn how many of the tools work by selecting a tool and instructions will appear here on how to use them. So, I'm going to go to Retouch and Restore and select Fade Correction. All I need to do is make one adjustment along this slider here and click OK. Now that's a lot better, isn't it? And it was so easy to do. Now all I need to do is save the image and return back to Photo Album. And the photo is updated automatically. If for some reason that doesn't automatically update, just refresh it by clicking another photo and going back to it. Okay, I'll do one more task for you that PaintShop Pro Photo is great at. Let's see if we can take some of Grandpa's wrinkles out, shall we? So I'll do the same thing I did before to get this photo over to PaintShop Pro Photo. Again, I'm already in the Retouch and Restore area, so that's perfect, and I'm going to select Skin Smoothing. Again, I have an adjustment slider here, and looks like really this setting looks just about right. Don't want to go too much or too less, otherwise it won't look very realistic. And click OK. Awesome. Save the photo. Return to Photo Album, and the photograph has been updated. So, try and do this as easily and quickly in that other, way more expensive application. And there you have it. Wasn't that easy? Thanks again, and have fun.